Everybody, welcome back in. Man, I just don't understand. Like, what are we tanking? I'm a Titans fan, unfortunately. Like, you might even call myself that at this point. I mean, I just don't even watch the games. But um, I'm just not interested in uh, NFL football right now. But um, I don't understand why you always play Mason Rudolph. Like, he's 2-0 and now as a starter. Like, why do you keep on wanting to play dumbass Will Levis? He's not good. There's, I just looked at his numbers. There's nothing there I like. I've seen highlights of him doing dumbass shit. I just don't get it. Unless you're tanking, this makes no sense. You just had Mason Rudolph fucking um, a win an overtime game against the Patriots. They put up over 400 yards of total offense. Now you want to go back to Will Levis? Like, I don't know, man. It's not, not something I would do. Like, your court is clear who your quarterback is. Will Levis cannot fucking play. He's not very bright. Quarterback has to be smart. This guy just does not, doesn't strike me as a smart guy. Like, the bonehead decisions he makes. Oh, I mean, I would guess his own team just really doesn't like him. Of course, they can't say it, but... I mean, come on. He's literally throwing games away. And they play hard for Mason Rudolph. It's pretty apparent. What do I know? I've only been watching the Titans since 1998. What do I know? I'm just a dumb YouTuber. Keep playing Levis. I'm sure it'll work out great. Look at his fucking numbers and tell me he deserves to play. Look at the highlights. Yeah, I've seen him play. I watched him last year. I don't like what I fucking see. He's got a great uh, frame, great build or whatever. Very strong arm. He's just not smart. He doesn't know how to use it. I've seen a lot of QBs come and go. Hundreds. He's not going to be one of the greats. Or even good. Yeah, have footnote NFL history. Somebody you overreached for in the second round. I was excited when we when we uh, drafted him. I love this lot This guy got great arm. I watched him play in Kentucky. He, he didn't put up big numbers there. Like the big arm didn't translate to any, any uh, fucking touchdowns or anything. I don't get it. Not even many yards. But they draft this guy anyways. He's from the SEC and he has a strong. Arm. Got to worry about what's between the ears as well. I like Mason Rudolph though. That dude's smart and he, he just knows how to fucking play. Like he doesn't just doesn't do dumb shit. He's a good game man, dude. Which is what we fucking need right now. It just breaks my heart seeing uh my team make decisions like this. Only Brian Brian Callen he wants to play him, does he? He's like, we're going to give Levis one more uh, week to uh, rest up from his injury. He's like, I want him at 100% so I have to take him out again. That's bullshit, Coach Speak. He wants to make some but somebody's pressuring him to play Will Levis. I mean, Brian Alcala isn't exactly a dumb guy. Like, to be a smart guy, he's smart. He had a great mentor in his dad, uh, Bill. He's there right now. I'm sure he's um, mentoring him or uh, Leo giving him advice or whatever. Like, I... Bill Callahan knows what a competent quarterback looks like. Holy oh, shit. They didn't mind one question. Who do you do play on? It's legend. The Max Mosey is just a show of his former self. Because he's never made a slider. I'm done with the Will Levis conversation. I just don't get it. I don't see any redeeming quality. That was a strong arm. And I guess intensity? This dumb guy intensity. Well, smart guy intensity like Tom Brady. Come on. <laughs> like, they see <seem> easy. <laughs> Just go get Tom Brady. Get it, baby! Yeah! So close. Baseball. He's running. He, Willie, why did you double Willie? Why did he double pump? It didn't even matter. That guy was an idiot for running. Holy shit. Dumbass. He's as dumb as Will Levis.
Tidy, yes, yeah, got him on the fingertips. All right, I'll be back. <laughs>